a whale. Do you get it? Hello, everyone. Welcome back to the channel. It's spooky season. And uh, I'm actually, it's not nighttime. Obviously, because you're watching this when it comes out, but uh, it is very early. It is incredibly early. I can't really, I can't specify how early it is because it's literally that early. I'm up against the sun, though. So we're going to go ahead and get into this little summon session here for Halloween Rhea. I'm very excited about that. Very excited. Also, I have my whale hat on because Halloween. See, this is my co this is my costume. I went much bigger last year, and I acknowledge that. We're not going as big this year, okay? Because Ray is about to take my wallet. So, uh, target heroes down below. You can see them: Ray, uh, Sothis Byla, and then Kirthnaga. If I don't get a Robin, I don't get a Robin. I'm okay with it. I don't really care. I don't really want to summon for uh, colorless things, to be honest. And this is spectacular. So everybody wins. Excellent. Okay. Green. We're starting off with green. Love it. Love a green. Love a green. Love it. Bowie. Could have been Raya. Well, not really, because it's a four star. But you know, it, it's fine. It's whatever. I'm just overly excitable, is all. Oh boy! All right. <clears throat> so, shall we dip further into the Ask Me Anything pool? Because there's a lot of you that submitted questions, but I haven't even gotten close to them yet. Uh, let's see. Brandon, are you a subscriber? You are. Thanks for that. Oh, by the way. I think Brandon's also a member. Thank you, members. Appreciate you. Uh, let me actually just double check something real quick because I think we're at a brand, like we're at the height of membership that we've not hit previously. And that is pretty gosh darn exciting. Uh, so let me, let me just double check that. Thank you, members. I appreciate y'all. Uh, we are actually at... 38 members. We are two members away from hitting a new emote threshold, uh, which is pretty awesome. So, you know, maybe we hit that soon. Maybe we don't. I don't know. But I appreciate all your support. Thank you all very much. Let's try and get us a Rhea. Woo! Very excited. I'm sorry. I'm like, I'm all kinds of giddy this morning. Uh, it's also like 6 a.m., so... Uh, all right, Brandon, who is a subscriber and I think a member, uh, you've been given the chance to join the Church of Saros. But oh no, uh, Rhea rules with hate and malice. <laughs> the neighboring kingdom is ruled by just a man. He strives to deliver peace and love to every citizen, but it's Oliver from Path of Radiance. Which side will I join? Uh, dude, I don't even know how to think about it. 100%. We're going Lady Rhea. Look, my Simpery knows little bounds when it comes to Rhea, so that's not, that's not even a hard question. But, you know, I appreciate it. <laughs> I do appreciate the question. Thank you, Brad. Uh, let's see. Priestkov. Priestkov? Priestkov. Also a subscriber. Thank you for that. Uh, do you regret building any of my plus 10 units? Do I regret plus 10 anything? Um, no. No, I don't think I do. Uh, I regret inheriting certain skills. Um, like Pulse Smoke on Soth. For example, <laughs> when, when his refine gave him pulse smoke and I wasted a pulse smoke. Um, but I don't think I regret plus 10 anything necessarily. 
or just building any plus 10 unit. Anytime you have a plus 10 unit, obviously that's like a lot of uh, dedication or just a lot of haphazard luck. There's a couple units, because you know, I've been playing since launch. Um, there's a couple units that I actually just have like, you know, plus 10 by, by sheer like accident. Uh, Flora is one of them, actually, who was, was recent. Um, so, yeah! Ooh, that's a five star. Okay. Oof. Okay. Our raid is broken. That's fine, though. That's fine. We don't have to pull on red anymore. We're, we're dunsies. Uh, we have, we have completed the Kurth Naga epic in our story. And so everything is great. Uh, and we can just dippity dop right on out of here. That is maybe not the worst. But I don't really care because we got them. Uh, so that's one down. <laughs> Blues and greens, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we are summoning for right now. Very happy about that. Don't have to pull anything else. And if by some odd chance we don't get blues and greens, we'll pull on red or colorless. Who knows? Um, so yeah, no, I don't think I regret plus tenning anything. And if I did, I wouldn't say. <laughs> uh, Pokey Hunter X, also a subscriber. A hey, let's go. I don't think I've seen any subs non-subscribers yet. Do you guys just click yes that you're a subscriber for fear of being shamed by me mid summon session? Outrageous. Uh, no, I trust that you're all subscribers because you're very loyal and you went out of your way to ask me a question, <laughs> which is like, you know, more effort. Uh, if you had the chance to demote any inheritable non-tier 4 skill, which would it be? Demote any inheritable non-tier 4 skill. Demote any non-tier 4 skill. Demote. I don't know that I understand this question. If I had the chance to demote any inheritable non-tier 4 skill... Which would it be and why? Is Swiss Sparrow 3 tier 4? I don't know if it is. I guess we got uh, we got Swiss Sparrow 2 demoted, right? That's in the 4 star pull now. So that's something. Uh, not in tier 4. Not in tier 4. Um, special Spiral. I'll go Special Spiral. I think I'm understanding the question. That's not a Tier 4 skill. That's Tier 3, right? Yeah. <laughs> I want more Special Spiral. That's that's really... That's all it is. That's all there is to it. I want more Special Spiral in my life. And I want that. Also, for Ask Me Anything, you guys ask a lot of Fire Emblem questions. How odd. Uh, Ruler of Try. Fun name. Thanks for subscribing. Uh, what kind of skill inheritance do you think could be added to help keep old units relevant? Uh, refined units are already starting to get outdated, and there's no hope on the horizon for them. Well, well, you see, uh, <laughs> what kind of skill inheritance do you think could help keep old units relevant? Um, skill inheritance for oh. God, Lou. Uh, oh, I hate you, little dude. God, it had to be him, didn't it? It really had to be him, didn't it? Oh, God, I hate you, Lou. I'm gonna when I get Rhea, I'm gonna feed you to her specifically just because you're annoying me right now, and I hate you. Uh, Lou. God. Ugh. I don't know why he's still a five star. I mean, I know why he's a five star, but I hate that he is a five star, and I hate that you're not Lady Rhea. Damn you, Lou. Ah, you're not even good. Yeah, I think it's just rally up Rez is what he has. Yeah, that's it. That's your only contribution, Lou. You have a rally up plus. Anima child. Yeah, okay. We'll get out of my face, Lou. I don't like you anymore. I, well, I never liked you to begin with, to be fair. So, But that's fine, Lou. That's fine. Lou. 
Oh, uh, God. What kind of skill inheritance do you think could be added to keep old units relevant? I don't think that's going to help old units. Right? Because old units don't have skills to inherit. So you'd have to remix them. Is that what we're getting at? Is that... <laughs> you guys ask some baller questions. Uh, is that what you're getting at? Remix old units? Remix them. That's my answer. That's all I have for you. Oh. <laughs> I thought... I thought I just had a five-star American. I got really confused. But, no, we're good. We're fine. This is great. I love this. Uh, yeah. Okay. Ruler of Try. Thank you for the question. I don't really understand it. Um, but hey, if you ask in a comment, maybe I'll... What is happening right now? Happy? Look, I'm glad to see you and all, but, like, y'all are making it really hard on me because I have to keep looking up your individual icon because you're not in my pool already. And it's making my heart sad. Okay. Uh, ha are you even in here? Oh, God. Did I even add you originally? Oh, no. Oh, no. Did I? Uh, oh, I did. Okay. We're fine. Everything's okay. Don't worry. Everything's all right. We're fine. <laughs> I got this. It's so early. Uh, all right, happy. Welcome to the squad, girl. I, mm, yep. Love it. Ooh, that's actually plus tack. Nice. Okay. Cool. All right, I'm less mad about that. Genuinely, <laughs> I'm less upset about that than I am the Lou for sure. Happy at least offers some kind of reconciliation here. Um, hmm. When when do I stop trying to pull Byleth? Or Sothis, rather. When do I stop trying to do that? Hmm. I think Lou is maybe one of the worst five stars that still exists. Outside of his Rally Up Plus, he offers literally nothing. Like, guys, literally nothing. Okay. Literally nothing. Is, I, I would put him... And look, I love Avil. Love Avil. Big Avil fan. I would put them in a similar category in terms of things that probably should not be five-star. Uh, it's... Oh, God, it had to be him, huh? That's depressing. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, what's happening? Please just give me greens. Please, game, just give me green stones. It's too early for this. My heart hurts. Uh, Fiori asked a question. Thank you for being a subscriber. Which skill would you like to see get an upgrade? How would you upgrade it? Which skill would you like to see get an upgrade? Uh, so I'm assuming this means going from three to four, right? Or, uh, well, I would say, like, enhancing distant counters and stuff, but that has... Bro, come on. Come on, bro. Just give me greens, man. You're killing me out of here. Sheesh. All right. Uh, what do I want to see get a tier four? I would... I do have Special Spiral on the brain lately. So that's kind of on my mind. Um, I would probably give Special Spiral tier four, like some kind of Wrath damage. And just make Wrath completely irrelevant. Um, Wrath is probably, I mean, I guess, I guess we do have the, the, what is it, the, the Spurn version of Wrath, so that's kind of like a Wrath upgrade, I suppose. Yeah. I don't know. Um, yeah, Special Spiral plus Wrath is what I'd like to see, or something along those lines. Just make Special Spiral better, because... The B passive, in particularly... <sighs> Why are you still not Rhea? I'm so frustrated. <laughs> I am so frustrated with you, Owen. You are not going on the board. You are a four-star. You... No. No. That is not what's happening here. You could have been a Rhea, and you're not, and that's disappointing. Um, 
Yeah, I, the the problem with B passives is it's a very competitive slot, right? Um, so they really have to be good, and I don't know with all of the like duo skill availability or uh, you know, the weapon upgrades or just you know the the C helpfulness, the the pulsing, and I don't know that special spiral is going to be able to hang much longer in particular um and i really like special spiral i very much enjoy special spiral builds <clears throat> and i just don't see special spiral uh living up to its potential <laughs> within probably like the next year or so uh because I, I have a feeling it's it's going to be overshadowed by something in the future so uh, special spiral with some kind of added true damage would be swell. <clears throat> That's a good question. I like that one. Joff. Like Jeff, but with, with an A. Uh, 2425. Also a sub. Thank you. Uh, I want to start growing and grooming a beard. <gasps> this is a non... Gaming question. Oh my god. Any tips or pointers on beard care? Yes. All right. Hear me out. I do nothing to my beard. <laughs> this might surprise you, but I literally do nothing. Um, I don't even... I Like, I have Dr. Bronner's that I, I wash it with half the time. Uh, I don't even use, like, special soaps or anything. Um, yeah, so it, it depends on the type of, of beard that you have, right? Uh, length, hair type, uh, if it's, you know, straight, wavy, coarse, thin, whatever. Um, so that will all vary greatly. But uh, I think the most important thing is uh, your skin underneath your beard can sometimes get very irritated. And so you always want to have a nice beard oil uh, that you can go to that can not only hydrate the skin underneath... Uh, but also, you know, keep keep this old thing nice and lush when you need to. Because uh, that will happen to me. And it gets really itchy and irritated. And so just a little bit of beard oil that you kind of rub in uh, tends to qualm the upset pretty easily. So that is, that is my recommendation. You don't have to use it all the time. Just find a really good beard oil that your skin doesn't dislike. Uh, I have very sensitive skin. I have terrible skin days. I'm sure you all know this. Uh, I record more often than I don't. <laughs> so you see me on my worst days more often than my bests. Uh, so, yeah, it's uh, it, it's it's rough. But, yeah, find a, uh, find a good beard oil that your skin doesn't get irritated or anything by. And uh, I think you're in good shape. Genuinely. How have we spent this many orbs and we still have not gotten a single Lady Rhea? And two non-focus units. The only focus unit we've got could have been a four star, but he was a five star. Why is this happening to us, you guys? We have a destiny to fulfill. Why? 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 Why, Faye? Why are you... <laughs> I want to say something, but I, <laughs> I want to say something, but I won't. Um, anyway, Jeff, thank you for your question. All right. Uh, Purparade, name that I know. Also a sub. Thank you for that. Uh, if you were to make a seasonal banner, like the Plegian theme, uh, what would you pick and who'd be there? Did I answer this already? This feels familiar. Did I answer this already? I don't remember. But the question feels really, really similar. Like somebody else asked it. Um, hmm. Interesting. I think somebody asked this already. I don't remember the answer that I gave either. Uh, but I will say that I think probably a Hoshiden themed banner, but like not a Hot Springs banner, just like a normal Hoshiden hanging out kind of banner would be kind of cool. 
Um, I also think probably a Foglin Academy banner is inevitable at this point. So get ready for that. Uh, it's not necessarily one that I would pick because I, I find the school uniforms to be kind of bland. Um, but <laughs> it's out there and it's definitely likely to happen at some point. So uh, that is that is a thing. But, yeah, I, uh, I think I'd probably go Hoshiden. Um, I like the concept of a Hoshiden banner. And also, I like the Hoshiden aesthetic. Because it's dope. That's my answer. I can't take it back. That's my answer. Uh, Ignis Aegis. Yeah, that's a dope name. <gasps> you are not a subscriber? Bro, can I... Let me just have a moment of your time, Ignis Aegis. You went through the hassle of watching my content, liked it enough to then go to my con like my, my description, click on a link that sends you to an Ask Me Anything form, and then wait patiently for me to answer said question in a future video. And you're not a subscriber? Bruh. <laughs> what are you doing? Make your life easy. Click the subscribe button. I honestly didn't think I'd see anything that wasn't subscribed. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, but hey, you're honest. You're honest. I'll give you that. You have terrible taste in, you know... Sub feeds, obviously, on YouTube because you're not subscribed to me. And I have a whale hat. So, uh, but yeah, I appreciate your honesty. I do not appreciate the fact that you are not a subscriber. Uh, what's your day job? I'm not sure you've shared this before, but I'm curious. Uh, I don't think I have. I usually don't talk about uh, my offline life. I used to call it my, my IRL life, um, but now I'm calling it my offline life <laughs> because both lives are equally real. <laughs> I realized I was, I was doing this portion of myself a uh, an injustice by, um, you know, calling it or basically insinuating it was my fake life. Um, but yeah, I don't think I've ever talked about it. I work in IT, and manage products for a company. I manage a software application product for a company in IT. That's as specific as I'd like to be. All right, moving on. <laughs> I'm not out here trying to get myself in trouble, y'all. I'm just not, okay? Don't, don't hate. I'm just out here trying to live. Are we at 4% yet? It's so dark, I can't actually see much. I don't know how many orbs we've actually used. It's, yeah, this is going south real quick, you guys. It's going south real quick. We are at 374 orbs. That means we've burned about 150. Oh my god. And we have just not happy is honestly the best thing that we've got, let's be honest. Both of the the first two are basically four stars, one of which is a four star. It breaks my heart. Alright, come on. Rhea. Please come home, Rhea. Please. Please, Rhea. Give me some glimmer of hope. God, Cher, how do you not have an alt yet? So frustrating. You deserve an alt. You do. Alright, we'll go blue. Let's get something here. Good God. Anything? No. Jaegen. Great. <laughs> uh, Logotius. Logotius. Oh my gosh, is it Logotius? That's such a cool name. I have no idea what it means. Uh, thank you for being a subscriber. Yo, let's go. Alright, I'm going to get to this question in just a hot minute. Just a hot minute. We have the green light in the background. It didn't help us at all. <laughs> Alright, never mind. 
two out of three. Two out of three. Best two out of three. Best two out of three. Uh huh? Uh -huh. No, Faye, go away. No, I don't like it. All right, green. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, give a guy a break. Ah, three star. Ah, you know. What do you know, huh? All right. Well, that was bust. God, I hate this. All right. Uh, Lagodius. <laughs> Such a cool name. Bets for next year's Choose Your Legends winners. And when's the Cypher Shop? I need all them Bilith cards. Okay. Uh, well, Gen ooh, God, that's a lot. Ooh, that's a lot of blue. Please be Raya. I'm gonna, I'm gonna feel so conflicted if I get a, if I get a Sothis here. Please just give me a Raya. Please just give me a Raya. God, Camilla. No, you don't wanna. Nah, I don't wanna see you right now. Oh, like, okay. All right. Let's just move past this, shall we? Let's just move past this. Maybe we don't even get a. Maybe we don't even get a Sylvus here. Maybe that doesn't happen either. Maybe that also does not happen here. Who knows? I'm nervous. I'm very nervous. Uh, Jenna was actually working on the shop last night. I finally bullied her <laughs> by saying, "You have until October 26th." I think is the date I gave her. It's arbitrary, really. She doesn't know that, but. She uh, <laughs> it was like if you don't if you don't have some kind of progress by this date, I'm I'm cutting you from the project, and uh, I'm I'm outsourcing it and I'm hiring somebody to, to build me a website, and um, that seemed to motivate her. So she she decided to put her uh, perfectionist self away for a hot minute. Oh my god, we got nothing from that circle, bro. She put her perfection herself away for a minute. We are 200 orbs deep now, by the way. Still nothing really great to ride home about, just saying. Uh, yeah, she made some progress. Uh, the website has a face now. So, we'll... <laughs> oh my god, I'm gonna... No! No! You are not, Rhea! God bless it! I hate you, Ephraim! I hate you so much. <laughs> Go away. Gah. You're not Rhea. <laughs> You're not Rhea. Leave me alone. God. I don't even. Are you. <sighs> Whatever. God, I'm so disheartened. <laughs> I'm so sad right now. What are you? Okay, great. Still have a broken rate, by the way. Still, still sitting pretty high there. Still, still up. Still looking up. Uh, next year's Choose Your Legends winners. Oh my. Okay, I'm not pulling on all these. I refuse. I can't. It's, uh, do I just do it? Oh God, it's breaking my heart to do this. Our our pity rate is so high right now. Are you kidding me? Dude. Okay. I know you're all like, oh, but four star specials are great. <laughs> no. <laughs> not right now. They're not. Okay. They're not. Even if it's Makaya. Again, God. I get the best IVs, Makaya. It's so stupid. It's so stupid. I can't. I'm building another plus 10 Makaya at this point. We might as well. We'll build, a, we'll build a speedy base Micaiah, or just another really nukey one. I don't know, but I have so many Micaiahs now. <laughs> she just finds me, you guys. It's not my fault, okay? She just shows up. Hey, there we go. We finally got something. Yay, it's not a Rhea, though. Feels bad. Ugh. All right. Well, bittersweet, because our raid is reset, but... Of course, it was the last one I pulled, too. That's the worst part. Hey, we take that. That's plus tech, which I think is what we want, right? Doesn't her B skill work off of attack or something like that? Am I remembering correctly? Yep, attack. Nice. Beautiful. Love that. All right, so we're... Oh, my God. We're 225 orbs-ish deep. 
which feels real bad. Uh, I still have not answered this question, by the way, just to point that out. Uh, next year's Choose Your Legends winners. Probably looking at Krom being a big contender. Probably looking at Byleth being a big contender. Uh, probably looking at Bernadetta being a big contender. And you're also probably looking at... Mm. Actually, I don't know. Women's is going to be more interesting, I think. The women's side is going to be more interesting, I think. God, game, if you do not give me a single Lady Rhea in like 500 ropes, I swear on Naga's fang, I will rip you apart with a very nasty review, okay? You can't just bait me with this S-tier art with Rhea, who is God-tier, literally, and then just not have her show up for me. I, I, oh, Balthus, first time I saw him. I find that very unacceptable. <laughs> He's a four-star. I forgot that he is in the four-star pool. We're hitting all around, man. We've got two of the four Ash and Wolves already. Like, we got, we got a Sothis. Lou is here for some reason. We hate him. Uh, there's just a lot of stuff that's happening. So, there's got to be Ray on the horizon, right? Anyway, I, I'm trying not to think too much about Choose Your Legends because I, I hate when that comes around. Because I have to cover it, but I don't want to cover it. <laughs> I don't want to, but I kind of have to. You know? Oh, God. It just, please, no meme picks this year. I don't want a meme pick. I, God, the conversation gets so toxic. and It hurts my heart to talk about it, and I just hate everything. So if we could not do that this year, if y'all meme stars could just take this one off, you know, you, you memed Brave Houses, you memed Brave Keep. Can we just not? Can we not do that this year? Can we just, can we just pick normal stuff? <laughs> can Throw sure put Byleth in there. Vote for Felix. I don't care, but just don't do weird stuff, okay? Please, I'm not here trying to say don't vote for three houses, but just don't vote weird stuff, please. That's all I'm asking. <laughs> don't make, don't make, don't please for me. <laughs> please inform your very important decision based around me. That's what I'm asking you to politely do, uh, which I know is a big ask, but I'm sure you'll all comply. None of you will comply. Uh, anyway, Legodius, thank you for that question. <laughs> Even though it took me like 10 minutes to get there, uh, we kind of, kind of got there. God, I can't even, like, before you have to click spend orbs, it doesn't really look like the colors. It's so dark in here. My iPad is like all the way down on brightness. <laughs> but it's spooky! I mean, what else are we gonna do here, right? I don't think I'm skipping any greens. I don't think I've skipped greens so far. We're, we're literally just pulling greens, by the way. Just want to point that out. Just pulling greens. That's where we're at in our lives. Uh, let's see. Thief of RPG. I know that name, too. Thank you for being a sub. Appreciate you. Um, also, a member? Or was a member? Uh, who is your favorite character from TMS? Ooh, good question. Maiko. Hands down. Easy. She is the boozy older sister that I never had. <laughs> For sure. Uh, is it Maiko? Hang on, let me give this some thought. Let me give this some thought. I really like Ellie, too. And I also really like Toma. Nah, I'll go Maiko. Maiko's easy enough. That's it. Krom? <laughs> Can I pick Krom? Krom... <laughs> Krom, uh... Krom Tokyo Mirage Sessions, for sure. Hands down. Uh, let's see. Usagi Tsukino. I think I said your name right. I hope that I did. I'm hoping I'm not just ignorant when I pronounce your name. Uh, am I... You are a subscriber. Thank you for that. 
Legendary Makai or Legendary Lincia? Which would you prefer, Legendary Makai? This must have been a really old <laughs> question. I'm so sorry, Usagi. I'm so sorry. Uh, it's a very old question. I'm very sorry. Um, King Smiley's. Are any of these green? No, I don't think so. We didn't have any greens in that circle. Feels bad. Hey, look at this. Look at this, though. Uh, thank you for being a sub. Appreciate that. Do you think it would be cool, or if, if or even possible, for the game to start adding old legendaries and mythic units to Hall of Forms? Uh, hypothetically, who among the first six or so mythical and legendary before pair-up would you want to see? I ask because they've gotten them in the background in the game mode, but they're MIA. Um... So, I mean, remixes are a thing. Because we get the base kit, I don't know that it's likely. Because, like, some of the base kits are... Kind of crazy. Um, plus, we already got a free Fjorm and Ike. So, I don't know... I don't know that people would form of those anyway. I mean, I guess they would, because it still saves on the inheritance, right? They don't have to actually do the skill inheritance. Um, hmm. I don't think it's likely. But, were it to happen, uh, I would like to see Gunthra and Ike. I think of the original eight, those are still my two favorites. Are they? Yeah. Yeah, those are still my two favorites for sure. So, Gunther Ike, I'd like to see. Gunther Hall of Forms would be actually kind of dope, not going to lie. That would be Pogchamp. All right. Uh, thank you for the question. Erica... Hey, thanks for subscribing. I know you're a member. Hey, all right. Uh, appreciate that. Question, who are your favorite ships, canon or not, in the FE franchise? Uh, Crom Cordelia. <laughs> How many people did I just upset by saying that? Um, <clears throat> no, I made a... I remember, like, years ago, I made a comment in Discord about how I would always pair up Crom and uh, Cordelia. <laughs> but I didn't specify in my head. Uh, <laughs> and then there was some confusion, rightfully so, about what I had just said. Um, <clears throat> yeah. Uh, can or not? I guess, it, I, I mean, Crown Cordelia isn't even possible. So I don't know if that's what you're, what you're going for. Um, I like... What do I like? What's my pick? <clears throat> Hmm. 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 You know what? I envision a world where Ike and Alincia get together and Ike becomes some kind of like warrior king nonsense and then that's it. <laughs> that's the plot. And everything that happens in Radiant Dawn still happens except Ike is a king. Right? <laughs> and he does everything he does as a king, which makes it infinitely more funny. Uh, and the one-liners even better. That's my non-canon ship. Ike Alincia. Yeah. I don't know if that's really the question, though. Non-canon would be, like, possible pair-ups, but not... Uh, not implied? Right? So I think uh, so. Like I think an implied canon would be like Roy and Lelina, right? Um, I think an Im an implied canon would be like Lynn Hector or like Hector Florina. I'm not sure, but again, I really do like the idea of Valencia and Ike together, and Ike just being this like badass warrior king that'd be pretty cool thank you erica i appreciate that question brave blitz also a subscriber thank you for that i can't see greens on my screen but that's fine 
Uh, favorite and least favorite Fates Royal. Ooh. Ooh, we're gonna upset some people right now. How have I still not gotten a single freaking Rhea? No, this is unacceptable. This is unacceptable. I, I do not choose to acknowledge this kind of existence right now. I refuse to acknowledge the lack of Rhea existence in my account. Alright? This will not stand. I will not be okay with this. I refuse to be okay with this. This is not alright. This is what I have been waiting for. Alright? I have decided to like Halloween because of this entire bear. Lady Rhea Halloween Witch Style is the only thing making me interested in Halloween this year. So, here's the deal, I asked. I am going to summon again, and if you don't give me any greens, I'm going to be very upset. Alright, well you gave me one, so I can't be mad about that. I appreciate you trying. God, green is awful to summon on. Your rates are higher, but the appearance rate of green stones is just absolute garbage. Anyway, all right, that was a rant. Thank you. Brave Blitz. <laughs> uh, favorite and least favorite royal. Um, I think my least favorite. Oh, God. No, let's start with my favorite. <laughs> let's start with my favorite. That's that's a safer thing to do, right? Um, <clears throat> are we including Azura in this? I don't know if we're... Probably not. Right? It would be weird if we did. Oh, hey, Perry. Perry showing up. Um, I think my favorite is probably... I, okay, so I'm not going to include Azura. It would be Azura. I'm going to say it's it's not... Like, I can't... It would be Azura, but I'm not going to include Azura. I'm only counting Hoshido and uh, Nor, uh, Nor. Yeah. I'm, I'm not... I'm not going to include Azura. Um, favorite not including Azura would probably be Ryoma? Let me think about this. Yeah, probably Ryoma. Least favorite. Ah, oh, that makes me uncomfortable. Least favorite's a little bit harder. Um, hmm. Hmm. I, I'm going to be real with y'all. I think it's Xander. I think that it's Xander. I think it might be Xander. Oh my god, you're going to be kidding me. Like, I mean, I'm, I'm actually, I'm, I'm like, I'm a little bit glad that it's not something that would completely screw me over right now, but I mean, come on, dude, bro, this is this is getting this is getting nuts. This is actually getting kind of nuts. Uh, I don't even know if I have Bravelin on here, dude. You know, what? we're not putting it. We we're not putting four star specials. It's too much a hassle, and I cannot be bothered. Lynn, you're another one. I'm probably gonna plus ten again. Lynn's another one that I, I like, I initially, on her first run, I pulled. Um, and then she just showed up so frequently, because the colorless pool at that point was just bad, um, that I ended up getting her to plus 10 without really trying much. She just kind of randomly showed up a bunch of times. Uh, yeah, did I answer that? I think I did. Thanks, Brave Blitz. I appreciate you. <laughs> Please don't cancel me on Twitter. All right. Uh, Ricky... Oneck, Ricky Oneck, with a capital K at the end. Uh, thank you for being a subscriber. Appreciate that. Uh, what steampunk? Oh, with steampunk being the current theme in book five, what themes would you really like to see in the upcoming books? Interesting. I don't know that I've really thought about that. I do appreciate the aesthetic of book five. Um, but I never really thought about what I wanted to see in the future. That's curious. Um, I think... Hmm. Oh my god, still not real. I'm, <laughs> I'm so sad. I am so sad right now. Uh, I'm trying to think of something that we haven't seen, and I don't really know... Like, obviously we're in this, like, predetermined fantasy world, right? 
Um, I don't really know that we've seen something... Like, my default is to go, like, really old or really new. Like, uh, like a sci-fi setting or, like, a period setting. And I don't know that either of those work well. I think steampunk works because it mixes new, like, new age with old aesthetic. Um, and obviously in any world that fits really nicely. I don't, I don't know. I don't think I have an answer for this one. That's one I'm going to have to sit with for a while. Yeah, I don't know that I, I don't know that I have one. Um, maybe something that's like really traditional, like knighthood kind of stuff, maybe. I don't know. That's a good question. I don't have an answer, unfortunately. I uh, I'll have to I'll have to think on that for a while. That one will stick with me for a minute. Uh, Roxas Heroes, thank you for being a subscriber. Know that name? Uh, do you think the game is changing too fast? We don't want to drive itself into the dirt. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I will say Roxas appears in multiple live streams. Uh, and they're always, they always come off as a little pessimistic to me, but I don't know if that's just their vibe. Um, and so the, I'm not surprised at all that the question has this tone to me. I don't think a game changing quickly will ultimately cause its undoing. Um, so fundamentally, I don't, I don't know what you're implying with your question. Um, but no, I don't think it's, I don't think it's changing too bad. Maybe you're talking about like power creep. I don't. I mean, power creep happens, yeah. But, like, power creep is one of those things where in the first year of the game, you either decide, like, oh, are we going to make busted stuff or are we going to keep it balanced? What are we going to do? Um, and then you have these kind of growing pains in either direction to based on, you know, which, which uh, fork in the road you choose. I don't think it's changing that fast, really. Like, if, if I have any complaints about Faye, it's that they just kind of take haphazard events and throw them against the wall and see what sticks. Um, and they don't they don't feel as thought out as maybe they could be. And so that's a little disappointing. But um, I don't think it's changing too fast now. I think they're keeping pace. Uh, especially like if you play other gotchas, like you'll know. <laughs> the real ones know. Uh, other games uh, have taken some heat, you know, they get bad feedback. I think, I think Faye kind of ebbs and flows, um, with a little bit of expectation. So that predictability is kind of nice, really. Um, so I don't think it's changing too fast now. That was my response. Uh, God, dude, are you serious? We're 400 orbs deep. We are 400 orbs deep, and we got a freaking loo so far. This can't be right. Right? This can't be right. I'm going to have to check my barracks again, man. This is nutty. We've gotten four or five stars out of 400 orbs. That can't be right. Right? We're not getting any greens either, dude. This is painful. This is painful. Oof, God, I'm getting nervous, y'all. Ooh, we're getting nervous. I'm getting nervous, fam. Oh, God, almost at 5%. This is freaking painful. Come on, just one Rhea. Oh, hot damn. Here we go. This is, no, this is it. This is it. Rhea's coming home. I don't care what anybody says. She is coming home right here. All right, we got three shots. Three? One, two, three. All three chances here. One of them has to be Rhea. Getting a lot of Luthiers. And by that I mean two. Which is great, because Swift Sparrow is awesome. 
Uh, oh, come on, Rhea. Please, Rhea. Please, Rhea. Please, Rhea. Please show me smoke. Please give me hope. Ah, Rhea? Focus? Yes? Orochi. This is just the demotes. <laughs> the little demote selection there. All right, well, that was disappointing. Um, what what was your first reaction when you saw Micaiah in Radiant Dawn? And what made you build interest in her? Interesting. Do you guys not like Micaiah? I, I get this question frequently where you're like, what's the deal with Micaiah? Why do you like Micaiah? I'm, I don't understand. What's the deal? Um, I just think that, you know, her, her lore is interesting. I, oh, son of a biscuit. This is, no, oh, God, this is freaking painful. I'm not going to get a single Lady Rhea, am I? I'm not going to get a single Rhea. <laughs> I'm not going to get a single damn Rhea. Oh, God. This actually hurts. This actually hurts. I, I woke up early to give spooky settings. I did the costume thing. I'm doing the simping. This freaking hurts. This actually breaks my soul. Bro, are you kidding me right now? God, four, over 400 orbs to get a Leon. God, this hurts. I'm sorry, I'll talk about Makai in a second. Uh, you know, you are not the one I need to see right now. Your child screwed me early on, Nino. How you feel about that? Gah. Please just give me greens. Okay, hope. Hope! The new run. Our pity was so high, we are still almost at 4% after getting pity broken by a fallen Leon. <laughs> I just want that to be known. That's how high our pity rate was. Okay. Uh, Micaiah. <clears throat> I like her lore. Uh, I like the kind of world building that her character creates. I like the difficult decisions that her character has to make. Uh, it's very similar to Rhea in that respect, where um, they're maybe not the most favorable character, but they're interesting. And it, you know, it's not always just like, a, you know, go this path if good, go this path if bad, you know, there's, there's something deeper in the inner workings happening, uh, with that character's motives. And I appreciate that. So, you know, that. I wasn't really a big Micaiah fan until, like, after my second Radiant Dawn playthrough. Full disclosure. Um, I was always much more pro Elincia, I think. And Elincia is still, you know, very high on my best girl list. Um, but yeah, I appreciate the stuff of Micaiah a little bit more. The more you play, the more you get to know. The more you know. Alrighty. Oh god. God. We guys, this is so this is so hurtful. Like this is just abusive at this point. I uh, uh, <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Please don't. Please don't. Okay, that's fine. Please don't do this to me, game. Please just give me a single copy. I was like, dude, if I get six copies of Rhea, I am feeling great. This is gonna be awesome. I got like 500 orbs, this is easy breezy. That's not happening. <laughs> this is, I'm, I'm literally just begging for one copy at this point. I'm not even gonna get merge out of this, man. I'm literally out here begging for scraps. Oi. Oi. Do you not appreciate my hat, IS? Is that what this is? Do you got beef with my hat? I'm out here trying to like promote your game and stuff. Alright, throw a gamer a bone here. Please and thank. Are we at 4% again? Oh, we're four and a quarter. Yay! Gotchas are fun. Alright. Oh, God, please just be a rat. 
Uh, Cyclinix. Cyclinix? Cyclinix? Cyclinix. Uh, thank you for being a subscriber. Appreciate that. Another Ashen Wolf. Great. Balthus. Appreciate you. Um, when do you think we will get Dorothea as her base version, and what do you think she will be like as a unit? I'm a huge Dorothea fan, and I'm still waiting patiently while I just keep sending her into fan service alt purgatory. Uh, tell me about it, brother. <laughs> um, yeah, so I think probably we'll just get Academy Dorothea. I think she'll probably be a Tome unit. I don't think she will have Meteor. Um, oh my god, dude. Are you kidding me right now? Another four star. Another four star special. Really? 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 Okay, great. Love that for us. Moving on. Uh, yeah, I think she's just going to be Academy. I think she'll just have, you know, the, the basic Academy stuff. She's going to be a five star, for sure. Um, yeah. I don't really know. I'm assuming she'll just be a tome unit. Because that seems to be her direction. Um, yeah. Probably, honestly, and it, it, I am also a Dorothea. I'm very pro Dorothea. Um, likely not to be anything special, unfortunately. And that's, that's part of the reason why I'm a little. I'm underwhelmed by Three Houses New Heroes banners because we all kind of expect them at this point to just be their Academy versions and they have some kind of, uh, there's someone on the banner that's like really good inheritable wise and then everybody else is just kind of uh, there <laughs> and I don't, it doesn't, it doesn't feel, it doesn't feel overly special, and I don't mean any kind of disrespect by that, but, it, you know, everybody's just in, like, Garrick mock attire. You know, they're in school uniform. And that's it. That's the banner. So, it, it all kind of looks the same to me, and that's that's not very exciting, I guess. Um, yeah. But I guess that's true for most new heroes, right? They're always in their, like, vanilla outfit, but... Uh, I think the, the, oh, really, really though, really, communication error, really, <laughs> great, nope, they still forgot Rhea, so, awesome, uh, yeah, I, that's, I think I answered that question, <laughs> I don't know that I answered it well, but I think that I answered it. Uh, Logo Go Go. That's fun to say. Thank you for subscribing. Do you think they'll make a the gender counterparts legendary, like male Robin and Corrin or female Violet? Um, I don't think that's the case. No. I think what they'll probably do... Hello? <laughs> I think what they'll probably do is they'll start, like, making different versions of the same legendaries. And I joked about this on a live stream a couple weeks ago. Um, I, I think they're probably going to try and revamp the same legendaries. Like, the remixes were a good start, but I think they're going to start giving alts to the current, uh, legendaries and mythics. Eventually. I don't know how soon that is, um, but eventually. I think that's probably what they'll do. Because there's, there's a chance that in the future... Uh, they they start broadening the definition, quote unquote, of what a legendary is, uh, or they just rehash the the same old ones. And I th <laughs> I think rehashing the same ones is far more IS's style. Um, so I don't know when that's going to happen, but I assume that sometime in the in the distant future that they'll start doing that instead, um, rather than you know doubling up on. The same characters. Because then you basically have the same one, but like a better version. Right? Yeah. That seems like IS's style to me. Uh, let's see. Elizabeth Snyder. Thank you for being a subscriber. We have 30 more. <laughs> okay. I want you guys to appreciate this real quick. I have spent 500 orbs 
to get no Reyes. <laughs> and this. <laughs> a five-star version of a four-star. A Lou. I'm not even going to dignify him with a definition. A Happy, who admittedly is, like, you know, pretty solid. Uh, Duo Sothis, who is good. And then Fallen Leon, who I don't have any use for. And honestly, inheritance-wise, a little bit niche. No Rhea in 500 orbs. To be clear, no Rhea. Anyway, uh, how did you and Jenna meet? Jenna and I met at work slash college, as most couples do these days. And uh, the rest is history. Yeah, no, uh, we met at work, uh, I left work, then we started dating, and then um, we have been together ever since. I think we're like, oh gosh, when did we, when did we officially get together? We got married in 2013, we were very young. I still feel like I'm very young, but getting married that young feels very young. <laughs> uh, knowing knowing now what I do. Because we've been together. We've been married for almost 10 years now. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, confliction. Oh, confliction. God, no, please. Oh, God. I don't know how to feel. It's bent, so I'm happy, but it's not Rhea. And we're 500 corpse deep, and I just don't have a single Rhea. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I don't know how I feel right now. I feel sick. <laughs> I want to vomit. Oh, God. Pent. Dude, no. <laughs> Pent, why? Why right now, man? God, you've had so many other opportunities, my dude. Why are you doing this to me? No. <laughs> don't make me feel like this. Guys, I don't think we're getting a Rhea. I'm going to be honest with you. I don't think it's happening. And that... Kind of breaks my heart. I'm gonna be honest. I'm feeling I'm feeling real low right now, y'all. I'm feeling real low right now, like really low. Oh God, Pent, my dude. Why? We keep getting up to almost five percent and then just dropping back down to almost four. Why does this keep happening? Why does this keep happening to us? Dude. I asked, what have I done? What have I done to make you upset? We have gotten a lot of Luthiers, though. I'll give it up for that. We've gotten a fair amount of Luthiers. Oh my god, dude. Like... <sighs> Bro, what is happening right now? This can't be real. Oh my god! No! <laughs> oh, God, you're stuck with me. I am. God, I hate you, Marianne. I hate this game right now. I'm. We're going to have to take a break, I think. Uh, look, I know y'all are like, yay, Fire Emblem Heroes. I. Mm. <laughs> oh, God. I, you know, I have to laugh, otherwise, it's really just goddamn sad. I. <sighs> Oh. Uh, not even a Byleth, by the way. Or a Sothis. Just, just, God, now we're at zero. Now we're at 3%. So we got back-to-back -back off focus. Uh. I'm a broken man. My will is broken. I am utterly defeated and sad. That is how I feel right now. Bottom left. Normally I'd have hope. Uh, but we are maybe at our lowest point possible right now. And uh, I, I just I don't see it happening. <laughs> yeah, yeah. 
yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. Okay. Hey, well, uh, listen, I am so glad I spent 525 orbs to get no Reyes. None. To be clear. Zero. Zero Reyes in 525 orbs. Great. Love this. Uh, I'm going to have a terrible rest of my day. <laughs> I will see you all on Friday for a live stream. Maybe. Who knows at this point? Uh, this is very upsetting. I am devastated. <laughs> and I shouldn't be, but I am. Uh, I'm going to go feel my feelings. Uh, members. Thank you, members. In these times of crises, I appreciate your uh, support more than ever. Um, right. Uh, everything hurts. Anyway, you got a really long summon session. I hope you appreciate that. Um, that's it. I'm going to go. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Appreciate you. Uh, subscribe if you want or don't. I don't care. Honestly. <laughs> no, it's a number, right? What's a number? Um, yeah, this sucks. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. This genuinely sucks. So, yeah. Okay, that's it. Thanks for watching. Appreciate you. We'll see you next time.